What's going on guys? Come back at you another video. This is going to be a recap of last night, Graph the Cyclones. Uh, we played the Vermont Lake Monsters, single A affiliate of the A's. Uh, we ended up losing 5-2, but it's all good because I got a lot of really good autographs. Um, here's my ticket. So, uh, last night was actually Italian American Heritage Night, which was cool because, you know, as you guys probably know, I'm Italian. So, that was really cool. I went a bunch of family. Anyway... I'm going to show off how I did. I got, first off, a program signed by Johan Urena. There he is. Really sucky autograph. But that's that. Then I got, finally got this guy. I've been wanting to get him since the first game I went to. But 6 of 6 from Joe Tushak. Signed the refractor. Chrome and 4 base. 1, 2, three and four so those are all the ones i had for him those i guess I could, i'll trade one or two of the papers if anyone's interested that's that and now the rest of the stuff honestly is mojo because you know it's the, it's the top two guys on the team um first off the logo sheet i added three guys we got two shack up there um dimas ponce right there and the best guy which i will show off in a minute down there Michael Conforto, our number one pick. He honestly is the nicest guy I think I've ever met. Um, he just was signing anything and everything for everybody, just talking up a storm with us. I am going to try and get close with him over the next couple games um, just because he seems like a really great guy and he was talking to me a lot just about stuff. But anyway, get to that in a second. Got uh, two game used baseball signed, one by Ahmed Rosario. I figured, you know, why not? It's a practice ball. I had him sweet spot that. People say he doesn't sweet spot, but he does. You just have to ask him to do it because he doesn't speak any English or anything. So I just pointed to the sweet spot, and he signed it no problem. So that's that. And now on to the mojo. Got Michael Conforto to sign two 4x6s. I ordered about seven or eight more, and then a couple more big photos and stuff. So I'm going to be getting this guy a lot. But there's one there of him in college uniform, inscribed number eight. And on the Cyclones picture, put number 39, which is cool because that's his number. Let me uh, move this down a little bit like that. So, there are those two. Pretty cool. Like I said, great guy. Then I got him on this awesome 85 by 11 photo. Signed it in silver for me. But it's from when he was at City Field, you know, taking BP and all with the team after he signed with the team. So I had him sign it up there in silver. Probably should have gotten the inscription on it. Um, so I'll probably bring that to the next game and have him do that. So that's really, really sick. And the last thing I had him sign was a game used Major League Baseball. I quoted the last game. that I wasn't able to buy a new one, so I'll be bringing one to the next game. But he signed that for me. And I asked him to put the 2013 first, 2014 first round pick, which he did no problem. Um, so very, very happy to have that. In my collection, so like I said, I'll probably be bringing a blank ball, a couple 4x6s, and I'm ordering an 11 by 14 of this photo to, um, to get them on. So I'm really pumped for that. And now the best thing I got on the day was actually a game-used item. They were raffling off last night's jerseys, and I got three raffles, but I didn't win one. But I was not too upset because I got this item a couple minutes before the raffle started. And what happened was, I went down to the dugout to try and get one of the cracked bats or lineup card, but one a kid had already grabbed one of the bats, and another guy had grabbed the lineup card, so I was pretty bummed. But I sucked my head like into the dugout and looked down the tunnel, and I saw this bat sticking inside one of the railings. So I asked, uh, who was it, Anthony Chavez, to grab it for me. He tried, but it was stuck, so he said he couldn't get it, and then he apologized, he went away. Then Adrian Abreu, I asked him to do it, he couldn't get it. Uh, Johan Urena, I asked him to do it, couldn't get it. Finally, uh, the ball boy or grounds crew guy or someone just went over to it and they started kicking really hard at it and he started banging on it. So, uh, finally, it popped out. He grabbed the bat, gave it to Adrian Abreu, who started signing, and then Abreu handed me the bat. So, very sick bat. Uh, my first one I've gotten in person, but it is a Chandler bat, uh, and it is game used and was cracked. Last night by catcher Tomas Nido. So, very cool. I was not able to get him to sign it. I'll probably have him do it next time right there in gold. 
because all this detail work is gold. Um, it's got this little bullseye looking thing right there. And then I'm going to pick this up real quick because the top of it um, has that Mets thing. It says Neato. So, very cool piece. My first bat, happy to get that. Well, I have my second bat, really, um, next to the Baxter. But happy to get this one very much. That's all I got for you guys right now. I'm going to be doing them again, Cyclones, pretty soon. So um, look forward to that. That's all I got for you guys today, and I will catch you later.